A sustainable building is one thing, but a sustainable home needs to focus on the comfort and health of the people who live there. The lighting system in the Honda Smart Home is the result of a collaboration with UC Davis researchers to maximize health, comfort, and efficiency. This home is very unique in that it's a pioneer in being an all-LED home uh, for all of the spaces. So it sets a really good example that it is possible, it is achievable. There are no incandescent lamps, there are no fluorescent lamps, it's all solid state LED. And it's gonna be one of the first homes that's all solid state LED lighting. And it's been known for a long time that light has a great effect on us in terms of our, of our well-being. There's a lot of mystery surrounding circadian. It's, it's actually a very simple construct where we try to replicate as closely as possible the natural lighting conditions that we all evolved underneath. To accentuate circadian lighting, what we did was we incorporated a number of innovations that dynamically change the color characteristics of the interior light just the way daylighting does. So there's different scenes in the house that are set for night and for day. This matches more of what you could expect and find in light in the middle of the day. In the evening hours, we'd want to remove that blue content and better match the quality of light that you would see around the evening hours. The smart home's lighting mimics the sun. Bright blue light during the day helps keep us alert, while amber light in the evening helps to avoid disrupting melatonin production, which would also disrupt sleep patterns. But this was also about safety and that's why we included toe kick and stair lights. Late at night, what you want to do is put in very low level night lighting to allow for safe navigation throughout the home. So if you do get up at two o'clock in the morning, you're not disrupting your circadian balance or bleaching your adopts in your eyes so you're losing night vision. So this was both a safety issue as well as a wellness issue. Some of the lighting in this home is something you could find at a lot of big box retail stores today. The thing to remember is to be a smart shopper by looking for highly efficacious products with the color quality that you want. So the kitchen lighting uh, is some of my favorite in the house. They have an extremely high color quality, which for me is really important in the kitchen because that's where you're doing some color critical things like selecting ingredients for dinner. And it's an opportunity for, for us to learn from the users what are the optimal conditions. This is really a laboratory for us. Our goal is for these research opportunities to help create a future where this type of smart design is the norm. These lights are a great example of how to save energy and really improve the quality of life.